Good morning, afternoon, or evening, depending where you are right now. Welcome back to Thumper's Lockpicking. I have the second uh, part of Average Picker. Uh, his in Strange Twain, Twain, T W I N, number two. Twain. Estranged Twain, number two. Uh, this is a bidding on the uh, key. Um, very much fun I've had with the uh, feedback on number one. Um, I've only picked this once off camera. Uh, so I'm going to try it on camera and we'll see what we got. Going to be using. Was going to be using, is going to be using, if I could find it. Uh, here we go. My Mad Bob Tension Wrench. And instead of using my beautiful, God, I love this pick so much, uh, chopper pick, I am going with the soft tail. Uh, the second uh, pick that uh, Jason uh, Carson has uh, uh, made me. Um, can't say how much I love both of these. I uh, hope the sun is hitting this right. This is two picks that are the most beautiful I have. I got more of Jason's. I'll always get more of Jason's. We have a strong connection. I don't know what it is. We have a strong bond. Um, I totally dig the guy. Um... And I would do anything for him. So, all that mushiness. Don't even think that, guys. You know what? I'm straight. Uh, straight. I just really dig this guy. He is very, very generous to the community. Okay, I'll leave it at that. Um, it is locked. And Mr. Softail, let's see what you could do. Click on one, two, oops, this is my tension wrench, three, four, and a small one on five. Back to beginning. Click on one. Nice one on two. Nice one on three. Another click out of four. Great click out of five. Nothing on six. Back to the beginning. Click at a one. Got some counter rotational number two. Okay. Got a little bit of a false set, not much. Three. Okay, nice and three. Number four, kind of rotation. Okay, now we got a great uh, false set going. That was four, I think, again. And it's just falling off the warding there. Okay, that was a good click out of that. Back to the beginning. Just 
a little bit of a counter rotation, okay. Two, and I got it. We're open. We're open, folks. All righty. All righty now. Can you say it again? Soft tail. Beautiful soft tail. You guys want some good picks made? Jason Carlson's the man to go to. Um, he's the man. He turned me on to a guy that uh, makes the pick holders. Uh, I am so blessed by him uh, turning me on to this guy. Uh, just a great, great deal going on here now. Let me just put this down in a second. Okay. Um, this will work just as fine as anyone. Uh, okay. Make sure we're in in frame here. I'll tip this down a little bit more. Okay. Okay, we got that. The pin. The spring. Uh, I think Bill Picardi gave me this uh, solid, uh, what you call it? What do you call it? I don't know. I keep forgetting. Fowler. Okay. Um, I really like these solid ones. I hate these hollow ones. All right. We'll set that down there. We got number one. I'll go over these in a second. Beautiful key pins so far. That's three, that's four, that's five. Um, nothing. 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 All right, the cores is completely stock. Let me really quick uh, turn these around here before I go on. Yeah, blah, 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 blah. All right. Do you like that? My blah, blah, blahs. All right. No mishaps. Number one. Beautiful. Simply beautiful. This would bar barely pop the sheared line. A standard in that one. A spool in that one. I uh, should have went from the rear, but she gets tired of that sometimes. I don't. Beautiful. Beautiful. And I probably should have done the springs one at a time, but I think they're all the same. It felt like it. And they are all steel springs. I didn't feel any differences in it. Or I would have done it one at a time. Uh, the Bible is completely stock too. Um, I really, really enjoyed number one and number two. Uh, average picker. That was very, very cool. 
Let me show you what I got. Hopefully nothing will happen here. Don't turn off. Don't. Okay. Here we are. I'll move this over a little bit. Okay, number uh, one on the key pin's got a serration on the top. Uh, number two is kind of tapered with a serrate. Uh, it's just tapered down like an hourglass, but uh, got to look at it after the camera. Okay, yeah, that's all it is. It's tapered down, but beautiful work. Uh, number three has got uh, one, two, uh, got two nice serrations in it. It looks like it's a little tapered down. Um, the fourth one is almost like a almost like a mushroom. It's it's got one serration in it. Um, and the last one's upside down. Um, let me fix that real quick. Uh, thought I had them all done. Um, it's got a triple serration, one, two, uh, double serration, um, tapered, tapered down like in the middle, beautiful pin work. On the top, we got a really nice tapered down, um, what do you want to call it? It's kind of like a spool, kind of like, uh, kind of like, wow, I don't know what to describe it, but it's beautiful. Two and three are standard four is like a, a it is a spool uh with a sharp top and the last one's got like three serrations in it very uh sharp very nice steel springs and everything and very well done average picker you're you're a great uh pin maker you're a great lock maker i really enjoyed these uh these two locks that you had all right, everybody, that's all I have for you today. This is my new setup. Might look like the old setup, but my desk is like a spring-loaded type of desk. Kind of like it goes down. Um, it's got springs on it. It busted loose and everything just fell off the table. Everything, everything fell off. I had to match all the keys back up. I had to match everything back. But this is my new setup. I'm going to give you a top view. Um, my little light. All my great little locks. I got to get into uh, picking the uh, lever locks. I got a really good... Uh, uh, from Andy Mac, I had a really nice case over there. But it only picks one type of lock. Uh, got all my bypasses and and uh and my uh what do you want to call it uh the cheap ch chinese ones of these the uh, and disc uh uh disc tool um bypass all that all, all that good stuff uh, i got some more picks i got uh my uh, whatever you want to call it, man. This is all my tools in the back. Um, that back there is a, uh, is like an infrared light or a black light. Um, great for taking splitters out. I mean, they pop up right close to that little mirror, but it's also great for a lot of other things. My way, my third eye. Um, I've got my... Where are you? My engraver. Um, some old time shackles. These are the locks that are um, uh, are done, that are going out. Um, these are my uh, picks. I got the Sparrows picks set here. I got the EDO and don't know what the other one's called, but fantastic little thing. Inside this Sparrows patch, in the back is actually got this little slit in it and it's got uh, it's got some um, tools in there for escape and release type of uh, situation uh, 
that my, was easy. My easy button. Locks I'm dealing with. Oh, munchies that I need. And what we got over here? Nothing. Got some cool knife collections here, guys. I don't know if you've ever seen these. One day I'll I'll publish all the swords and the knives I have. Old time bayonet. Very cool Rambo knives. Uh, you name it, I got it. Here's. I got to make it over here. I don't know if you want to call this old Betsy or whatever, but in the handle, I, I can't probably do it one hand, but let me kind of hold on a minute and I'll show you. Oh, that was my armpit that hurted. In the handle itself, you pull the handle out. It's got a knife built into the handle. Um... And that's all Betsy, I guess you would call her. Uh, I got some other cool stuffs over here in the back there. Uh, that's the Freddy Krueger or whatever you want. I don't know if you had three claws or, or two claws, but I got that. I got boxes of knives, dude. I, I have so many knives. Uh, I got crossbows. I've got... I, I, I just got a lot. So I just wanted to go through actually my new desk setup, um, which collapsed and now is now back together. And I'm feeling better about it. All right. Okie dokie. Don't let old Betsy get to you. Uh, it's a nasty little weapon. All right, guys. Just joking around. Please, let's not set a uh, bad example for our sport. Don't put your picks in anyone else's locks unless you have explicit permission. All right? This stuff keeps me going. I don't want bad names, you know, for people that are, they're going to pick on us when, when someone does something stupid. There's always someone stupid out there. Let's not be you or me, okay? Thank you. Brothers, sisters. Thank you, Jason. Love you, dude. Love you, brother. All right, everybody. I'm gone.